Hey everyone, so I just saw the new Cats trailer and <laughs> wow, come on, oh come on, why are we doing this? So I'll preface this by saying that when I was a kid, somewhere around 11 or 12, I actually saw Cats the Musical. My sweet baby bird mind thought it was spectacular, even if the music didn't quite feel like it was good. But I liked it up until the point where I became cognitive and I made my own decisions. I think Andrew Lloyd Webber is incredibly overrated and kind of a hack, and there are thousands of better writers, veterans, and up-and-comers alike that can outdo Phantom any day of the week. And while I'm not terribly big on mainstream musicals, I do appreciate them when they're done right as a whole. I can appreciate things about Cats. The, the dancing's pretty good. But obviously the musical must have some charm because now it gets its own film. Am I crazy? Am I the only one who's asking why? A am I too old to understand this stuff now? I'm in my early 20s, man. I didn't think I'd be this out of touch with what a mainstream audience wants now, but apparently I am. There's not a lot to be taken away from this trailer other than the obvious face composition. That's cool now, you know, we just put actors' faces on other actors and call that performance, gotcha. As I mentioned earlier, the musical has pretty good and intense choreography. It's no surprise that instead of using seasoned and talented new faces to pull off the stunts, we are just using their bodies and putting someone else's face over it. And that's all the musical has going for it. That's all the Latin had going for it. Remember the genie? I don't. The musical has one number. One good number. Here performed by Jennifer Hudson. She does great so far. She always does. But this trailer pulls out the very typical, oh, we're going to have new intense dark adaptation shit and pulls out the go, 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 go. <laughs> we get it. You're trying to make it look like it's different than any musical before. And it's not. And the cast? I don't care how they got Jennifer Hudson or James Corbin or it just fucking Elba, but how? How did they get Ian McKellen? If the film has anything to rely on, it's that something must have persuaded Sir Ian McKellen to be in Cats. Because I have a feeling that the studio looked at the list and said, Well, well, we can't make an animated Cats because nobody takes animated films seriously. And we can't just CGI composite people in fursuits because not only will that look bad, cost a lot of money, and take a lot of time for something that's not terribly worth it, except they didn't say that last one, because look at what we have now. That was a little crass, I apologize. It's just getting very hard to understand or handle musical adaptations now. There are so many fantastic musicals out there that could translate immensely better than this one. Musicals like this can't make the cut on film because it has a heavy reliance on choreography, which is spectacular on a stage. You know, you get to see everything, every dancer, every motion, everything. But it won't be great on film. I have a feeling that this film won't hold in people's memories. Thanks for checking out this video, and if you don't think I upload enough content on here, you're right. But I have a different job that isn't related to this at all, so it's harder to make video content. But feel free to check out my website where I upload stuff daily. Right now, I just posted an article about German Expressionism. That's not boring, right? Anyway, take it easy, and I'll see you around.